Hello friends, my name is Radha Masood. Today we shall discuss about a topic that what is data processing system. Friend, today's topic uh, is very interesting and I am hopeful that you would like this video. So first of all, I would request to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you. So let's uh, start friend. So today's topic is data processing system. Um, friend, data processing system basically we are referring to a computerized system in which the computer receives the data from different locations and after processing it will produce some reports or some output or result okay so that is a general term of data processing so data processing occurs when data is collected and translated into usable information usually performed by a data scientist or team data scientist it is important for data processing to be done correctly as not to negatively affect the end product how uh, what are the stages of uh, the data processing first of, first of all data collection uh, as a uh, as a person as a user you have to collect the data collect the data means friend that you have to uh, different resources are there like for example warehouses or um, some person who is entering the data in in, in excel sheets or in any notepad so uh, you have to collect the data so first of all first of all the most important thing you have to collect the data what you can do like for example for example you are making some analysis for example you are making some survey so what you do you have to collect the data that means you make a form uh, and take a printout of that form and you talk with different people and uh, ask them to fill that form for example and you can say for example 5000 people have filled the form after that data preparation data preparation means that once the data is collected then enter the data preparation stages data preparation often referred to as pre-processing in that uh, stage at which raw data is cleaned up and organized for the following stage of data processing so that means friend for example you have collected the data in on the papers okay then you have to prepare that data prepare that mean means there for example you have to enter it uh, you have to prepare the data for example you have to categorize that how many uh, people have entered uh, data who have a uh, having age more than 40 uh, 40 years who have the age less than uh, less than 30 years for example so you have to do the pre-processing you have to organize the data first you have to collect the data then you have to prepare or organize the data after preparation you have to do the data input data input means that you have to enter the data into the system like any CRM system any uh, computerized based system you have to input the data uh, into the system once the data has been entered yeah, the processing will start like computer will do the processing you have to make some algorithms computerized algorithms some mechanism through which the data will be processed okay for example take the same example of uh, uh, the uh, survey for example you have collected the data on the prep uh, on the papers then you organize the data then you enter the data into the system and then once the data has been entered the system will process the data once the data has been processed the data will be output output means that for example any type of dashboard will be displayed on the computer any type of reports will be generated that can be saved in excel or any other format any pdf format so the data output is the result the data output result means any reports dashboard or the data will be provided so to some any other system as well then in the last uh, step is the data storage data storage means that data should be stored somewhere uh, for example the final stage data processing storage after all the data process it is then stored for future use for example data can be stored in database uh, in any excel files uh, in any hard copies for example so you have to store the data generally we use the database to store the data so that it can be used in future as well so uh, friend uh, thank you thanks a lot for watching the video i hope uh, you like this video if like please share it with your friends and colleagues and thanks for watching the video thank you